Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to this CarTech video. Uh, in this video, we're gonna show you how to change the mileage on a uh, Kia Sportage, uh, or any Kia really. Uh, we're using the X-Tool X100 Pro 2 kit, which uh, I'm gonna put a link to this kit in the description below this video, and also in the comments box below this video. So this is the tool here, um, it's plugged into the diagnostic port. One end of this cable is plugged into the tool, one end is in the diagnostic port. Um, once the tool is plugged in, you really just need to go to the dashboard setting here so we we'll click OK to that and it's going to ask you to select your vehicle so we're going to go to Kia and we're going to select our vehicle which is a Sportage there is Sportage GT and R as well but we're just clicking Sportage um, if you're not entirely sure which one of these is correct just it's just a case of trial and error uh, for us we need to click on this bottom one here and it's going to ask us miles or kilometers so it's going to ask us to put a new file in. This is basically um, a backup file. Uh, we can click new file. So we'll just click. We've got. We've already got a few other files from from different vehicles. So we're going to go through the process of making this zero three. Okay, and then it's telling us what the mileage is now. Twenty seven two nine nine, which is close enough. Um, we're going to change this now and we're going to go and say for example we want the mileage to be 31,188 uh, I'm going to say 31,188 so we'll click OK to that communicating it's done a quick refresh of the dashboard adjustment complete and it's giving us now 31,189 so it's giving us within one mile um, which is which is close enough I suppose um, so yeah adjustment complete and that's all thanks to the X-Tool X100 kit as I say it is a, it's a great tool to have if you are in the business of changing uh, mileage adjusting mileages um, if you're a mobile mechanic a garage a workshop or you just need to do it on your own vehicle covers a wide range of vehicles so I'm going to put the link to this kit in the description below this video and also in the uh, the comments box as well thanks for watching this CarTech video and I'll see you next time